This is verse 4 of the 19th chapter of the Gospel of John. We've just seen Pilate treating Jesus to the remarkably abusive and horrific torture, really, of the Roman scourging. And now, once this is over, we pick up the story once again, as John tells us, Kai, the connective, exhale thin from exerchemai, I go out. This is the third person singular. Uh, aorist active indicative, so he went out. Paulin is an indeclinable adverb, it means again, so again he went out. Exo, another indeclinable adverb, it means outside, so he went outside again. Then the subject of the verb, ho pilatos, pilot, so pilot went outside again. Kai, the connective lege, from lego I say, third person singular, present active indicative, and he says, autois, the indirect object, um, masculine, or dative plural, mag, masculine. And so Pilot says once again to them, referring to the Jewish people, especially the leaders who were demanding uh, the crucifixion of Christ and the announcement that Pilate makes, ide, this is an interjection, it means uh, behold, look, ago, first person singular, present active indicative of ago, which means I lead, so behold, I lead, who men, the dative, plural, uh, second person pronoun, so I lead to you, outone, the uh, third person pronoun, this is the masculine singular, so behold, I lead to you, him, exo, uh, same as we have up here, exo is uh, an indeclinable adverb, it means outside, so behold, I lead him outside to you. Uh, hina, conjunction, takes the subjunctive with genota, this is from Gnosko, I know, this is the uh, second person plural, aorist active subjunctive going with henna, in order that you may know, hoti, uh, in this case means that, udamian, combination of two words, uda and mian taken together would be not one thing, rather an emphatic idea, that not one thing, itian, and then from iteo to ask, this is a noun form of that, which uh, meant a charge, some kind of claim or basis for guilt, in order that uh, you may know that not one charge uh, is uh, heurisco. This is the uh, first person singular, present active indicative of heurisco, means I find. Uh, and so in this case, he's saying not one claim I find, not one charge I find in. A uh, preposition takes the dative, and here's the dative of the masculine singular pronoun, dative singular. Not one f uh, charge or claim uh, do I find in him. Not one basis of guilt, you might say, is found in him. So Pilate, uh, with a breathtaking inconsistency, has subjected Jesus to this most horrific kind of uh, Roman punishment, the scourging, uh, and yet admits, uh, admits that he doesn't find any basis for any punishment whatsoever. A scourging, uh, let alone crucifixion, uh, and Pilate probably appealing to the humanity of these people, hoping there'll be some scrap of uh, sympathy that will be aroused, but of course nothing of the sort is going to take place.